Hello guys and welcome to the One Motorhome channel, uh, the channel where we try to find the perfect layout, the perfect design and basically the perfect motorhome for you. Uh, today we're demonstrating a lovely compact vehicle, this one is called an Auto Sleepers Symbol Plus. Um, it's built on a Peugeot cab, it's got 165 brake horsepower. Uh, we'll start off on the outside having a good look around and then we'll go inside and go through all the specification and have a good look at the layout. So starting off on the front of this vehicle, as you can see, this one comes in this lovely blue color. It's got take daytime running lights. It's got privacy glass all the way around. Just beneath here, you'll be able to see it has got an electric step and it's also comes with the alloy wheels. Um, at the back of the vehicle, just here, it's got an external barbecue point. So that is for a gas barbecue and that's linked directly to the tank underneath. And then just above, you can see it's got that LED strip light and a huge Chule canopy to protect you from both the sun and of course the rain. Um, really kind of incognito van, so it looks really cool. Um, walking all the way around, just to show you this privacy glass. Let's have a look. There we go. So it goes all the way around. Now it's a specially treated glass, so it keeps out the UV, uh, UV rays and you can open these back doors here let's have a look and this gives you access to your toilet cassette which lives in here this one you can shut off your uh, gas and in this one you've got your heating system and that is a whale heating system but I'll show you the rest of that inside and obviously you've got a little hatch there going into the kitchen walking around the other side now Again, these nice alloy wheels that come with it. If you can see there, we've got two vents, one here, one here, which means we've got a fridge and a freezer on board. You can't quite see on the roof, but just at the top there, you can see part of the digital TV aerial. So it's got a digital television aerial on this. But if you want, you can plug an external satellite here or connect to a TV aerial system on a campsite. This is where you fill up your fresh water with a hose pipe, this one. And this one you can suck water from a container into the vehicle or you can actually connect to a main supply if you're on a service pitch. All plugged in at the moment down here so this is where you plug it in either at the campsite or at home and it's got refillable gas so it's got a 25 litre uh, refillable gas tank just inside the door here you've got a little gauge and that will show you how much gas you've got on board and also we've got these which is actually for air suspension at the back so you can adjust the ride on this vehicle uh, which is great actually so if you've got a lot in the van you can pump that up so it basically pumps the back of the vehicle up but uh, take a look at this vehicle really really nice let's go inside and have a proper look shall we so just opening the sliding door on the side and then inside look at this we've got a really nice sofa on uh, the far side here which two people or even three people actually could quite comfortably sit. Um, just here, this seat here has got a forward facing seat with a three point, a three point harness seat belt. So it can travel three, um, three seat belts. So you've got two in the front and one here in the back. So you can travel three uh, and sleep two. It's a two berth. Um, this whole area converts into a big double bed, but I'll show you an image of that shortly. Just down here, we've got a three pin plug. Uh, obviously this is for your lights and that is for your electric step in and out with this one. It's got an up to date uh, Zenex stereo and that has got Apple CarPlay, Android Auto and also your reversing camera screen will go onto here. Uh, so you can link your mobile phone to that via Bluetooth. Multifunctional steering wheel, uh, as I mentioned, six speed manual gearbox. It's got cab air conditioning, cruise control. Uh, you have some cup holders beneath here and there's plenty of storage space in here so you've got a, a glove box down here and also another kind of glove box up on the top here however this one you can blow cool air into this so you can have your bottles of coke or your chocolate in there um, also you've got the leads for usbs to charge your mobile phone or plug your mobile phone in and that will connect it to the stereo um, and again usbs here as well and then you've got a 12 volt socket. Both the driver's seat and the passenger seat, they both swivel around. Uh, so they're both captain seats. 
and you have got concertina cab blinds going all the way around so you've got a blind here blind coming around there and obviously the same on the other side just above the cab got a handy little storage area and there's a fold away table in here and that can be used either in the living area or you can use that outside so it doubles up as an outdoor table to save you bringing another table with you lots of storage one two three so three big cupboards actually just above that um that sofa and then beneath those cupboards we've got these lovely lights actually which you can move around on the tracks so the nice led lights they're, they're a clever design and um, basically the way they're made like this is when you're walking past them they won't glare you but underneath there it's actually really bright so it's a, it's a good design that just here we've got a little sort of magazine holder where you can put bits and bobs in there which is quite nice um, and just to the right of these cupboards we've got another one here and this is a big wardrobe for hanging clothes and things like that you've got a little cocktail table in here which can be used very cleverly actually uh, just down here so this is a new vehicle so I've not taken the stickers off it yet but that table will, the leg will go into here and obviously the table will sit up on top but you can have both of these seats spun around and you can use that as a little break table so if you're just stopping quickly for a cup of tea it's very nice this is a view of the inside of the vehicle so we've got storage underneath this sofa and a little bit of storage under here and just in this one here, we've got wine bottle holder. So if you like a glass of wine, you've got a handy little cupboard for that. This chair basically slides forward. So you've got this little button down here, this one here. You push that down and then this whole chair will slide forwards and that will turn into a single bed. If you would prefer to have a double bed, you can then pull this one out those cushions come across and this whole area turns it into a big double bed which is uh, very comfortable actually um, and it's easy to make up moving down now this is kind of the showstopper for me it's absolutely amazing you've got a huge kitchen in here so you've got a little coffee machine that comes with it obviously the sink um, three gas burners and a nice size oven plenty of storage in here as well so underneath the oven you've got this big drawer where you can keep all your pots and pans and things um in here is where you obviously keep your knives and forks round here another big cupboard and again a plate rack nice cupboard in there as well um next to the coffee machine we've got a 12 volt point two three pin plugs and then above that we've got a plateless microwave so that plateless microwave basically saves it from rattling around as you're driving. Up top, here we go, Auto Sleeper's famous glasses, crystal glasses, and then a bit more cover space there, and then two more up top here. But if you like cooking, this is the perfect van for you. I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, just above, just to point out, we've got a fan here. So this is an extractor fan, so it'll either suck the smoke or the air out or if you want you can reverse it so you can blow in cool air and then just to the right of that you've got your toilet and shower electric flush toilet nice shower actually touch sensitive lights in here so one touch on one touch off and vice versa um little um thing at the back there to actually keep your shower gels and stuff like that nice mirror for getting ready and then a sink just below uh, this all closes off obviously close this round like this whoops like that so that's a just a view of it with the door closed really nice handy handy van um i mean if you didn't have enough workspace over in the corner there they'll even give you a bit more here um so it's a great great kitchen just to give you a view standing from the kitchen into the living room area um, you've got a little cupboard in here, so you've got some storage in there and again another cupboard up on the top here and inside there's your Wi-Fi system so this has got a Wi-Fi aerial on the roof so you can connect your laptop to that or a television um, and just to let you know this vehicle does come with a flat screen TV and a soundbar. Um, 
up on the top here you've got max view so this is a boot a, a signal booster you've got a little three pin plug on the top and a lovely area for getting ready really nice led light all the way around the uh the mirror there which you can turn on and off for this um and then some cupboard space beneath but yeah really really nice if you're a bit worried about getting changed in this van uh very cleverly you can open this cupboard door like this like that let's have a look see if i can show you this that one comes around and then that one comes forwards like that so then it's all blocked off look at that so you can stand in the kitchen um getting ready getting changed and no one can see inside so just to give you some of the dimensions and the specifications of this van um it's a really really nice compact van uh it's just under six meters in length and it is uh 2260 so just under 2.3 meters in width so it's a really nice compact van uh, and, and the kitchen at the back is amazing uh, the overall height is uh 2640 so it's around 2.6 meters in height um, and the internal height is actually uh 1.9 meters so it's a really nice van where you can stand up. So if um, you'd like to know, that's six foot three standing up. And obviously you've got more room above your head there. You can drive this on a standard license. So it's a three and a half ton chassis. So you don't need any special licenses for it. It's got a payload of 490 kilograms. Um, it's got a fresh water tank and a wastewater tank. The fresh water tank is 69 litres and the wastewater tank is 40 litres. So it's a really nice, well-equipped, compact uh, van, obviously made by Auto Sleeper, who are known for quality. So this particular van has got the premium pack and the winter pack on it. So the winter pack, you've got uh, heated blankets over the tanks. So it stops the fresh and the wastewater tank from freezing. It's got the concertina cab blinds in lieu of the cab curtains, and it's also got an upgraded heating system. Uh, the premium pack um, is uh, uh, alloys reversing camera solar panel digital tv aerial wi-fi all that sort of stuff um great van fully loaded um i've fallen in love with it i have to say so guys i hope you enjoyed this walk around tour of the auto sleeper symbol plus a great compact van really really nice it's the thumbs up from me um, if you like the channel or if you like the video, actually put the thumbs up on the video. Also, if you've got any questions or if you just like to say something, put it in the comments below. Uh, and also, if you're not already subscribed, subscribe to the channel, press the little bell icon and you'll get up to date um, notifications of as and when I'm putting videos on. But I'm putting them on all the time. So we will eventually find the perfect van for you.